It's three o'clock in the morning. Uh, yeah, a little bit after three. But it's three o'clock, nevertheless. I'm here at the shipper up here in uh, Streetsboro, Ohio. I'm still in Ohio. Clock is running. Y'all want to know why my clock is running at 3 o'clock in the morning and I'm still here at the shipper? Well, I don't know why I am still here at the shipper. In my opinion, I'm supposed to have been loaded and gone already. I'm supposed to be somewhere up in Illinois right about now. But I am here in Ohio. Let's talk about it. Anybody following that R. Kelly story like I am? Oh, yeah. That Gail King interview is real good. Gail's all calm. She was amazing. How can I work? How can I get paid? How can I take care of my kids? How? Your ex-wife. Sounds like a good song. Can we get some music? <laughs> Here's the deal. Here's sure. The deal. I'm just being honest. I don't know how to hog that, people. What would I hog that? You don't want to believe it. How? How can I pay child support? How, how can I work? How can I get paid? This ain't not about music. How can I take care of my kids? How, How can I work? How? How can I get paid? How? At this point, we briefly pause the interview to give Kelly a moment. Robert. 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 Nice. You asked for it, you got it. Put a little music, and you got the new R. Kelly mix. That's pretty good. I just don't know what to say about uh, uh, this. My like, this is not my first time here. Um, this is not my first time being here, but this is my first time getting loaded here. So, like I said. I, I went to him twice, you know, in the morning time because I'm over here thinking like, okay, you know, like three, maybe, maybe four hours. But I, I wake up, I wake up at three o'clock. Now, mind you, I've been here since eight o'clock last night. Uh, I'm not locked. I'm not locked. I am backed up to a dock. And they, they got me. I, I, I don't know. Can y'all, can y'all see what's in there? Is, is I'm loaded? I don't know. I don't know. But I've been here since eight o'clock last night. So let me tell you how I got here. All right. I was, I was on time. Okay. I was on time. So it wasn't like I was late and I was being worked in. I was actually on time, you know? So when I got here, they put me in the door, put me in door five. I'm like, cool, all right, bet. So next thing I know, you know, I feel a couple of shakes here and there. And then I, I haven't heard nothing else at all. And I'm like, oh, maybe they've got one of them quiet tow motors or whatever. So. I, um, I, uh, I go to sleep. I was like, all right, well, I'm going to go ahead and get some sleep so I can go ahead and do this night drive. I'm, I'm still thinking I'm, I'm still thinking I'm night driving. So I, around three o'clock, like I said, around three o'clock, I go to the guard and I'm, you know, asking the guard for an update and I'm like, yo, gee, um, what's up? <laughs> What's up with door five, man? I gotta come 
all the way over here to Streetsboro and get stuck in the door for damn near 10 hours. Well, it's, yeah, damn near 10 hours. Well, no, eight hours. Well, I don't know. I don't know, but I'm, I've been stuck in the door. Dude, why do it take this damn long to load? Or unload, for that matter. Good morning, man. What's up, man? Yeah, you, you tell me what's up, man. What's, yeah. what's up with door five? Door five, I'll let you know. One second. Uh, you're 36% loaded. 36%. Forty what? Wait. Yeah. What do you mean forty two hours? Like forty two like hours? Around for 42 hours. Yeah, you're, uh, why why was he waiting around for forty two hours? They're just way behind, man. Sixteen hours. Uh this is your load right here. You're thirty five percent loaded, not even fully picked. What time did you get here? Man, I got here at eight o'clock last night, man. Yeah, they're running super behind, dude. What if I may be so bold to ask, why is that? Uh, well, when uh, DHL took over this facility, there were 70 to 80 inbounds still left in the yard, and there still are. So they've just been playing catch up, man, for the last week. It's been, uh, it's been hectic, and you're not the only one that, you know. I don't, I don't, I hate to say, you know, I, I feel for you, man. That's got to fucking suck, dude. But there's like absolutely nothing that I, I mean, we personally can do about it. And we've just been having this problem. All week. Uh, I mean, uh, what well, y'all short, y'all short staff. It's, the, it's our system. Our system. We're working out the bugs. Working out. You know, we're trying to figure out the most efficient way to run this facility, essentially. And this is the first week, you know, that we've been doing it. So. Forty-two hours, man. That is ridiculous. Oh no. I Dude, know. been I here mean, for two days. Well, his his load's been getting loaded. Took them, you know, he had an appointment time say 6 p.m. two days ago, and it took him till now to get that. Y'all hear that? Did did y'all hear that? Did tell me you guys heard all of that, man? You can't. So what we got to do? Shrug our shrug, shrug, shrug our shoulders and just say that's trucking. That's ridiculous, man. The ShipEx guy, and shout out to ShipEx, by the way. That's uh, If that's a company that you're looking into getting into, ShipEx would be that company. But 42 hours. That man been here for two days getting loaded. Oh, well, let's check and see. You know, you get on this little computer, he's tit, 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 tit. Oh, you're 30% you're loaded. I'm like, 30% loaded? I'm like, are you serious? 30% loaded? It was like, yeah, 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 you're 30% loaded. Yada, 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 yada. I was like, all right, so what, we got, a, we got a ballpark or something like that? He was like, well, he was like, well, um, that, that one, uh, the one driver from ship has been here for 42 hours. I was like, are you serious? I was like, he been here for, he, I was like, he been here for, for two days. You serious? He was like, yeah, you know, um, some company DHL just brought, uh, just took over and they're like, they're like about a day and a half behind and yada, yada, yada. And I go, I go, well, what 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 that mean? Like y'all y'all don't have enough people in there to 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 work? Well, no no, it's not that. It's the computer system. I'm like, it must not be the computer system. How how is you blaming the computer system for somebody slowly filling my truck? He was like, I I don't know, you know. But we we've been having problems since Monday, since uh since they took over. And so I was like, all right, well, ballpark it for me. He was like, well, give it to about 7 o'clock. I got your phone number. I'll give you a call. And um, and we'll see what we can do. Uh, we'll see what we can do from there. So I'm like, 
all right, fine, no problem. I said, okay, seven o'clock in the morning, I'll get with you in the morning, and boom. All right, so I'm sleeping, I'm sleeping, I'm sleeping, I'm sleeping. It's six o'clock now. So I go, uh, you know, I, I, I wait a little bit. I, I ain't wanna, I ain't wanna go over there to him right away. So seven o'clock or uh, uh, seven o'clock rolls around, and I finally get out of the truck. I go over there. I still got the red light. I go back there in the back. They they still got me on the dot, door open, and everything. So I walk over to the uh, guard house and I go, uh, "What's the update for door five now?" This chick tells me. She gets on the computer. Tick 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 tick. She tells me, "Oh well, you're." Uh, you're 65 percent loaded. 65 percent loaded. Well, you, well, you almost there. I was like, look, man, what? I said, this is ridiculous. Now, come on. I said, 10 hours, just to only get, just to only get 65. Unbelievable. I still got the red light. I'm still here. It's, oh, oh my God. I wonder what it's look like in there now. What y'all? What do y'all see? Y'all see anything? This is. Where there's no other trucks in this damn parking lot. Ain't none. I'm the only one. Well, the prime truck down here but so uh what's going on with door five you are 66 percent loaded why why is it taking them damn near 10 hours just to just to load the truck I mean, Well, you mean product like what? Product that's not here or they... Or it's on a truck that's in the yard, but um, at some point they would decide to just say, hey, we're just not going to ship that product. You know what I mean? They're not going to keep you here until they... <laughs> you know what I mean? But, um, so what what that mean? They just going to ship the product that's already on the truck or they just going to take the stuff that they put well, they on? they might have it right now being unloaded off of another truck. So that's just something but I know that um, everything that we have available for your truck, it's like 99% fully picked in the warehouse and ready to go on the truck and you're 66% loaded. That makes no damn sense to me. What's going on in there? I was like, you know what? Why, why is they why is they holding me up like this? What's, what's the point? What's going on? Uh, well, you know, we got a new company that took it over and they doing this and they doing that, yada, 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 yada. Um, we'll, well, we'll, we'll call you when it's done. So then I was like, I turned around and I was like, hold up, wait. I, I, I said, uh, I said my shipment, I, I said, I gotta be in, I said, I gotta be in, uh, I gotta be in Minnesota by tomorrow. Like tomorrow you know what i'm saying because the load delivers at six o'clock monday morning so i gotta at least be in minnesota like tomorrow you know what i'm saying so i literally like i said i literally did a 10 hour here like i mean like come on I said please don't play with me i said don't don't play with me right now because I'm I'm over here. I'm hungry for number one. I'm frustrated. Number two, you know, goddamn well we don't get paid unless we driving. Come on now. Um, 
I am getting the detention. I mean, you know, and yeah, this this detention better be a nice one because this is crazy. But but still though, it, it's ridiculous. It makes no sense to me. And of course, everybody going to turn around and say, "Oh well, you know, that's trucking. That's that's trucking. That's trucking." Yeah, that is trucking. But still, still, it, it makes no sense to me that that these shippers and or receivers take this damn long to load something. Now she also in a, she also said the fact that that they're taking they're loading my truck with some other load that's on another truck that they're waiting on. Or it, the the load probably might be here in the yard, so we got to wait until they put it in the door and unload it. Ain't ain't y'all supposed to already have that that stuff here already set already ready to go you mean to tell me I gotta <sighs> so we can't we can't penalize you guys for for you guys holding us up but y'all can pen up, penalize us if we come late that, that don't make no sense don't make no sense and I don't think it's fair man I don't think it's fair at all so, yeah. I tell you know I tell them I, I forgot to say I tell them that I'm I'm about to go I'm about to unhook so I can go get something to eat, but then they turn around and tell me, oh well we we can get you loaded now well we we got you on a priority now. I'm like, <laughs> ain't nobody ain't nobody here like, of course I'm priority now ain't nobody here. Make sure that no one's on that truck while you want to blow. That's cool. So, who, who, who are we waiting on there? Are, are you sure? Because like I said, I've been, I'm starving and I've been here since Sir, 8 o'clock last night. All I can tell you is what I'm being told. So, half hour, 45 minutes. All right. Okay. That's... Okay, cool. Thanks. Uh, bye. Yep, they changed the priority so that the pickers would, or that the loaders would get to yours right now. Okay. It's only like one, it's only like one one or two trucks and the Snyder truck just just pulled up maybe about a half an hour 45 minutes ago so beforehand ain't nobody here so of course I'm going to be a priority now y'all can hurry up and get me done how come y'all couldn't hurry up and get me done last night ain't nobody here hell the trucks that pulled in after me is gone that's that's why I'm like I'm I'm looking like like really ain't no ain't ain't nobody here all the trucks that was here last night with me is gone it's like i woke up in the ghost field this morning like where's everybody at so i go over there i'm like oh well you're 60 you're 62 percent done well you you can't be serious right so then when i tell her i'm about to unhook for my truck I mean, for my trailer, so I can go and get something to eat. Oh, now they can find a way to to hurry me up. But that's but now it's what what time is it? Eight forty one. Eight forty one. Yeah, that was at like seven seven thirty. It's eight forty one. So it's an hour freaking later. Oh my god, that's trucking for you. I'm gone, I ain't coming back nah, nah, You gon' have to settle with another man yeah, yeah. But when you realize, don't be running back oh, Ain't no 
sunshine.